Welcome to Matt's Workshop. I'm Matt, and today we're going to check out some Origin jeans. Thanks for stopping by. If you're here, you're probably wanting to buy a pair of these Origin jeans and really want to get a little bit more information about them. Hopefully I can help with that. I'm making the kind of video I wish I found before I bought them. Um, Origin is a U.S. company, and they are trying to source everything from the U.S. So that way the whole supply chain is in the U.S. so we don't have to worry about overseas. Um, from the textile fabrics, the leather, the brass for the rivets, every single part they are sourcing from the U.S. made in the U.S. by U.S. workers paying a good wage on U.S. machinery. So I definitely want to support that when I can. These are obviously going to be on the higher end price-wise because of that. Um, they are typically, I believe, around $125, $135 each, give or take. Uh, they have sales that go on. If you buy two pairs, you get them for $99 each. That's what I did. Follow them, get on their mailing list, whatever you need to do to get that deal. They make denim. They make boots, which are awesome looking. I haven't got a pair yet, but I want a pair. They make awesome hoodies. One of my favorite hoodies now is the Origin hoodie. Um, they obviously have shirts that they make, but they make, um, geese. They just launched a hunting gear line and an active wear line as well, which is awesome. And I want to get some of that stuff too, but like most of you, um, you can't spend that much money all the time. Um, again, I try to support them when I can, and this is my <laughs> most recent purchase. And I do plan to order a pair of boots um, in the future. I gotta look into them more to see exactly what style I want. But if anybody from Origin watches this, this is what I want. I want a slip-on style boot. I think that would be awesome. I think you guys could make an awesome one. I think they'd sell really well. So let's dive in. So right now my go-to pair of jeans are these Levi's 541s. The dark wash. So this is what I'm going to be comparing those to. Um, I took measurements on these before I ordered those. So we'll see how the fit is, see how it feels, and go from there. I really don't like buying jeans online. I like to try them on. I know Origin has a higher quality standard, so I'm hoping that they are true to size. Everything I read, that's what people were saying. Levi's, I can buy two pairs of the same jeans online, and they're going to be different size. They're going to have a different fit overall. For example, these Levi's that I like so much, uh, on the tag here it says they are 34-32. But I actually, so when I actually measure them, I actually got 36-30. And so that's what I ordered from Origin based on the, the true measurements of these jeans. And I guess just for a little reference point, I'm about 5 foot 10, uh, 235 right now. So, and I carry all my weight in my gut. <laughs> so, I have high hopes. Let's get into it. I had these for a few days and I had enough self control to not just tear right into it. I knew I wanted to do a little review, kind of, it's just a first impression review, right? I'll do a quality, you know, later on down the road once I wear them for a while and, and see how, how they hold up. And I'm going to try them on with three different shoes a pair of work boots. A pair of Romeos and a pair of Converse just to see how they look on all three of those shoes. I got two pair of jeans, got the factory fit and the Delta 68, uh, legit fit, both dark wash. So these are the factory fit jeans. Nice dark color. I don't know how well that's going to show up. With that stitching, with the brown stitching, looks cool. I know that they have their shark fin style, I believe is what they call it, where the pocket is a little bit higher on this side. Just a nice looking pair of jeans. There's the Delta 68s, so they have a little stretch to them. These, I was a little concerned about these. They don't look like they're gonna be bad. Um, I don't like real tight fitting jeans. They have this fit. 
They have the legit fit, and they have another one. I forgot the name off the top of my head. I'll put it right here. And those were even more of a slim fit. And then I saw comments were like, oh, these are slim, and those are extra slim. So I bought them anyways just to test them out. So let's compare the fits. These are the Levi's. And these weigh one pound, 8.6 ounces. So I think I'm going to prefer the factory fit ones, so I'm going to try on the Delta 68 first. I do have a couple pairs of jeans that have a little bit of a stretch to it, and that is nice when you're, <laughs> when you're working around having to squat down, things like that. That is pretty nice. The Delta 68 weigh 1 pound, 4 ounces, and they are 86% cotton, 12% polyester, and 2% spandex. Let's try these on. And nice deep pockets. Just go down a ways. So these Delta 68s fit uh, better than I thought um, around my thighs. They're a little bit baggier than I like at the very bottom, you know, um, especially for like a Converse, like a real thin shoe, canvas shoe or something like that. They're a little, the uh, they're a little bit bigger on the opening than I, I normally like. They're they're okay, and they're, it's nothing I wouldn't wear. I just prefer a little bit more, a little bit smaller opening onto the factory jeans now these are definitely a thicker material just a basic they don't, oh let's see two percent spandex 70 percent cotton and 28 percent polyester there, there's a tiny bit of stretch in there let's check them out pockets again these pockets are actually made out of the same denim material as the jeans they're not a lighter material so because of that it is a little bit more difficult to get your knife on but not a big deal at all
So for first impression and fit review, I think they both fit really well. Um, I'm excited <laughs> to start wearing them and, and see how they hold up. I don't, I don't work uh, physical. I'm a, I'm a factory worker, but we have, we have uniforms and the position I'm in now, I'm actually in the quality department. Um, I moved up through manufacturing and went to the quality department. Uh, so I don't put a lot of strain on my clothes when I'm working on the property I have some car hearts and things like that that I wear that I can put knee pads in but just just regular wear I feel like these are gonna last a long time um, I'm not too hard on my clothes in general but I think I prefer the the factory jean a little bit more and I kept saying factory fit I know that looking back it's the factory jeans um, I just kind of like that heavier feel and it does have a little bit of stretch to it, so it's nice and comfortable. The It, it looked a little bit better around the Converse for some reason, but uh, when I lined up both pairs of jeans, the, the opening is actually about the same size. I don't know why. It, to me, it looked a little bit different, but I prefer the factory jeans a little bit more, um, and I believe they're $10 cheaper or so if you're interested. And they have three different colors. They have the dark wash, um, a medium wash and a light wash. I prefer the dark and if you want it to look worn go out and wear it. But it's great to be able to buy a pair of jeans online and they fit really well. So I suggest if you want to buy a pair whatever pair of jeans fits you the best measure, measure the waist, measure the inseam and that's what you order from Origin. I hope this helps uh, a little bit if you're you know it's a hundred dollars for a pair of jeans and it's it's a lot of money, especially when you can go to Walmart and pay $30 for it. Um, so hopefully this gave you a little bit more information. I'm sure I missed some things, and there's probably some other reviews out there. Um, I know there's some reviews of like actual like stress tests and things like that that are pretty cool. But if this helped you at all, I'd appreciate a like um, and, a, and a sub. I'm starting to get into this, uh, you know, build this channel a little bit. I'm not very active on it. I'm trying to get better on that. We've just been busy working on the property and not having time to actually film the work. Appreciate you for stopping by. God bless.